you all know, Nirvana is a sort of spiritual enlightenment by which you can get peace, happiness. How can all that coexist with the aggressive and metallic sound of your music? I wouldn't call it metallic. Well, it, it could be aggressive. I mean, as long as you're let go, you can just let go and enjoy it without distraction. Then um, you're having fun and getting the point of the music. Yeah. How important has been the sub pop experience in Seattle together with bands like Madonna and, and Soundgarden? Do you think that's a sort of starting point for a new rock scene? Yes, yes. Love, love that rock scene in Seattle. It's fine. That's a new starting point for the next decade coming. Um, I think it's, it's started a lot for this decade. I mean, yeah. if it wasn't for those that whole scene, then, you know, maybe we wouldn't have become so popular. Maybe the music in general wouldn't have become so uh, accepted by people. The mass. video you shot from Smells Like Teen Spirit is one of the best ones we ever seen. There is a sort of crescendo shared both by the audience and the band itself. Can you talk about its making? Oh, it was a day's shooting of the video. It took about 12 hours. We invited 200 of our friends down to the studio, and they sat in bleachers, and we had a good time. But there was a lot of smoke, this artificial smoke machine, and it got black stuff in our noses, and we were picking black stuff out of yeah, our noses at night. There was a lot of black stuff. But I think that the people who came down and did the videos, they made the video what it is. For all, the, all of our friends who... Uh, pretty much destroyed the studio <laughs> that we did it in. It wouldn't have been half as exciting. The lyrics of your song are against the wrongs of the Western world society. People keep on saying, never mind, you don't. What are the things that make your anger explode? Gluttony. Materialism. Wealth. On the cover of the Nevermind album, we can see a newborn baby swimming underwater, trying to catch one buck. Is that related to the upbringing, the educational system we undergo? Everybody's everybody's grown to value the dollar bill, and it sort of uh, uh, symbolizes success, capitalism. Like that baby isn't a person; it's a consumer. You know, and that's what they all say. Consumers are spending less this holidays, you know? Beings, they're not humans, consumers. they're consumers. That's an ugly word. Consumer. Consume. You always combine hard rock riff uh, in a punk and uh, underground attitude. Still, there is something more on your last record. Could you explain what is that? I think you pretty much said it all, really. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the choppers. <laughs>
Gotta have-